to use our tools to do more with less. Now let's talk about data and AI. It's all about two things, getting your data estate in order and applying large AI models as platforms. That's the dual challenge. This is the age of AI. The core business logic is no longer just being written by developers, it's being written by software. In fact, by 2025, 10% of all data will be produced by generative AI models. Analytics is moving from backend processes to being critical part of the product experience. And so how are you using this intelligence? How are you helping your customers translate it into more predictions, more insights, more actions, more automation? It's hard to overstate the opportunity. What we are seeing is the convergence of previously disparate categories. We are the only company that has a complete data fabric from the operational stores to the analytics engine to data governance with our Microsoft Intelligent Data Platform. Let me be super clear. This is not just about best of breed. It's about bringing the best of suite. This allows organizations to spend more time creating value and less time integrating and managing their data estate. Just think about the time and effort that goes into aligning your operational stores and analytics with new regulations. Or just imagine the total cost of ownership if you try to do all this integration on your own. Analytics alone on our intelligent data platform is about 4.8x faster and costs up to 59% less than other cloud analytics vendors. Today, 70% of the Fortune 1000 use two or more of our data solutions, and we're seeing leaders from every industry, from AT&T and KPMG to Manulife, unify their data and reduce costs using our tools. Walgreens was able to achieve 3x the performance at one third the cost when it migrated to our data platform for their analytic needs. When it comes to AI, we're seeing a real paradigm shift as the world's large AI models become powerful platforms themselves. In Azure, we have built the most powerful AI supercomputer in the cloud, and we've used it to train these large state-of-the-art AI models. But it's not enough to talk about these models, it's about applying them. We are building models as platforms in Azure so that you can apply these advances to any use case, including some of the biggest challenges we face as a society today. Orsted, which produces a quarter of the world's wind energy along with our partner Cognite, has used our tools to turn data from its offshore wind turbines into insights for predictive maintenance. Let's take a look. Erstel produces a quarter of the world's energy from offshore wind, and we have a leading position as a sustainable energy company. When you run wind turbines, you need to have data about their integrity. The wind turbines are standing outside in a rough environment offshore, and working offshore is in a harsh environment and a dangerous environment. Previously, we had two colleagues standing outside the confined space and two colleagues going down into the confined space doing the manual inspection. With the innovation that we're doing together with Microsoft and Cognite, we're trying to innovate how we inspect the confined space. We want to digitalize it by bringing in new technologies. What we do with the drones is that we fly inside these structures and we collect imagery data and other sensor data from the drone and we run computer vision models to detect corrosion and cracks. Cognite Data Vision is built on Microsoft Azure and partly integrated with Microsoft Intelligent Data Platform. Data scientists can combine data from IoT sensors with telemetry from the drone and the 3D model to create actual business value. We have a precise location of where do we have corrosion. In the new setup, we will only need two technicians where the technicians stay outside of the confined space and let the drone do the work. It's actually a first with the industry that we deploy this in offshore wind in the confined space. We get a faster inspection, more energy production, we get a cheaper solution, we get a safer environment, and I think everybody wins. What a great example, and I just love the impact they've been able to have